Top Humanoid Robots 2022 Your favorite science fiction films are on the verge of becoming reality. From iRobot to Steven Spielberg's AI, futurists and soothsayers have foretold the emergence of a new species, the humanoid robot. Finally, now it's time to be overwhelmed. These mechanical wonders will not only walk and communicate, but they will also perform all of the duties humans don't like to do. From jaws to mining. So what are the best and most promising humanoid robots of this year? Well, today, we are going to discuss what the top humanoid robots of 2022 are. Hello, tech nerds! Welcome back to AI Future Life, a versatile YouTube channel where we bring the latest updates on stock, science, finance, artificial intelligence, and many more important things. Before we proceed to our topic, subscribe to our channel and keep following us by clicking the bell icon. So, without further delay, let's get straight into the subject. The humanoid robot used to be a horrifying innovation for civilization as it got shaken by the idea of widespread unemployment. But over time, we understood these robots are our future. While robots are already prevalent in industries throughout the world, with their robotic arms screwing on automobile wheels or manufacturing high-end electronics, the humanoid robot has remained elusive until now. Humanoid robots are frequently criticized for their impracticality. That hasn't stopped researchers all around the globe from creating humanoid robots for a variety of uses, including avatar robots, construction robots, robotic assistants, domestic and research robots, entertainment robots, and the world's most advanced humanoid robots. So now we'll go over some top lifelike robots of 2022, which are currently being developed. The most advanced robot avatars are currently being developed in Japan. For example, Toyota's robot THR3. The humanoid robot can accurately simulate a human operator's actions, such as walking and delicate finger movements. The one and a half meter tall robot has 32 joints and moves quite smoothly. The control is straightforward, the range of motion is comparable to that of a person, and the operator can see through the eyes of the robot thanks to the VR helmet on his head. The robot's purpose is to engage with humans. The model was last updated in 2019. However, it is still simply a concept for the time being. Next, Milton is working on technology that will aid in the creation of cyborgs in the future. These include the processing of biosignals via nerves in the human body and the development of robotic goods that mimic human anatomy. The business now has two humanoid robotic avatars that can effectively mimic human movement. Milton Arm Ace has meticulously replicated a human's anatomy, down to the position of muscles and tendons leading to individual digits. Polymetric elastic wires are employed as actuators, pressure sensors, and in the fingers of robots, with haptic feedback provided by the feedback system. The robot is extremely precise and powerful. With just two fingers, it can carry a two-liter water canister. Milton B, designed for interesting customers for dangerous work in environments with high or low temperatures chemical, biological, or radioactive contamination, and even possibly for space exploration, can transfer signals from the operator to the robot with a delay of only two hundredths of a second, from a distance of 19,000 kilometers. As a result, the humanoid robot can still communicate with humans, not just via grasping force, but also through item texture. After that, there's Model H in Japan. It is Telerobot Existence Avatar for remote shopping and travel. The HTC 5 Virtual Reality Helmet and two controllers are used to control the robot. The robot, which is installed on an independent wheeled chassis, has two arms and a swivel head, with two stereo vision cameras. The Model T robot merchandiser, which was released last year, is a progression of the concept. Shop staff may direct the robot, which functions as a merchandiser, from home using virtual reality. A 15 millisecond delay in video communication between the operator and the robot does not influence synchrony. The robots are already in use in the Family Mart stores in Japan. The business is focused on making the robot work more quickly. However, some robots are even more human-like. Sarkos Robot, for example, is working on a variable robot dubbed Guardian XL that will be mass-produced next year. The battery-powered, full-size exoskeleton boosts operator strength by 20 times, allowing you to lift loads of up to 90 kilograms without fatigue. The Guardian XL dynamically compensates for gravity and inertia detecting the operator's movements in milliseconds. The suit's 24 degrees of freedom ensure free and natural movement, and the hands-free mode allows the operator to leave heavy loads in the hands of the robot, freeing their own hands for more demanding tasks. The robot suits can be put on and taken off in under 30 seconds with no help. 
The Guardian XL serves as the foundation for the Guardian XD robot, which can now be operated from a safe distance without needing to be put on. Humanoid robots are appealing in the realm of building and repair because they can utilize the same materials and equipment as humans. Take the HRP-5A robot from Japan's National Institute of Advanced Industrial Science and Technology, for example. It can pick up and carry large and bulky cargo, open doors, travel up and down stairs, avoid obstacles, and utilize basic hand tools. The robot does not require continual monitoring from the operator and can complete a variety of activities on its own. Move or fasten a sheet of drywall, for example. Unlike the HRP-5, the RMR-6 robot from Secondhand Robotics is meant to assist people. The robot must be able to grasp natural language orders and recognize what a person is attempting to achieve in advance, as well as foresee when it will want assistance. Furthermore, the robot will be able to do activities that need a degree of precision or physical power not available to employees and it must do so autonomously and securely amid a crowded warehouse. The RMR-6 was tested at a warehouse last year as part of the project's evolution. Meanwhile, next-age robots from Kamata Robotics are already at work in Japan's Glory Factory. 19 robots and 300 people work together to assemble equipment that sorts money for cash registers. The humanoid robots have cameras in their hands and are capable of superhuman force, speed, and precision when doing difficult repetitive procedures. Simply installing next stage where humans use to labor, it may be used without any safety obstacles. Once more, thank you. Multiple next generation robots can work on the same task at the same time by coordinating their motions. Walker, a humanoid robot from UBTech Robotics, is another aid robot that is now domestic. In the field of humanoid robots, the business now possesses over 700 patents. Walker is less than a meter and a half tall and is capable of recognizing surfaces, mapping terrain, avoiding obstacles, walking up and down stairs, maintaining equilibrium under external stimuli, and manipulating numerous things. It reacts to verbal commands maintains eye contact, and can operate with people safely. This robot can recognize the host, detect and track targets, and offer an assessment of human posture thanks to 36 high-performance actuators, a wide range of sensor systems, SLAM technology, and a system with artificial intelligence aspects, making it one of the most advanced robots in the world. Separately, in this edition, research humanoid robots are worth mentioning. They are created to assist engineers to grasp what they can accomplish in theory, not to solve specific challenges. Of course, the Atlas robot from Boston Dynamics Dynamics is the most well-known. Contrary to common belief, the robot does not have artificial intelligence, yet it is unrivaled in dynamic movement. This robot stays balanced when executing intricate motions thanks to cameras on its head, 28 joints in its legs and arms, and many centers throughout the body. When told to execute a somersault, the robot uses a library of movement trajectories that it has built, but it adopts them to real-world conditions in real time. Serena 4, an Iranian research humanoid, was recognized by the American Society of Mechanical Engineers, not Atlas. The robot can recognize faces and objects and reproduce speech, and move at speeds of less than 1 km per hour. Serena's arms have 43 degrees of movement and can grip things of various forms. Engineers in Iran are using robots to study two-legged locomotion, artificial intelligence, and to encourage students to pursue careers in engineering. On a different note, if today's episode reminds you of Honda's Asimo robot, we are sorry to acknowledge the project is over and we won't see this robot again. Let us know if you know of any additional sophisticated humanoid robots in the comment section. And while you're here, like this video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any new episodes from the world of tech and AI. We'll see you in the next one. Until then, peace.